I, you, he, she, we, you plural, they. Yo, tu, el, ella, nosotros, vosotros, ellos. Gabrielle. We met in a Thai themed bar, seating booths parted by dried grass, chiseled bamboo straps. Me swingers tropical poured out from the mouths of totem poles, red lighting dimmed to sultry. Me, the only one who had brought a dictionary, but still, for two months it had been me and a mirror conversing. Excluded from my own youth, I craved an evening a little diferente. Gabrielle offered a drink. Una cerveza, por favor. A fishbowl with two oversized straws returned. <laughs> I asked where he worked. He asked if I moved alone. I requested street slang. He returned from another toilet trip with another fishbowl. <laughs> and clarified exactly what the evening was about. <laughs> you like to salsa? Salsa. The dance of puzzle piece hits, fitted chests. No, no. I recall my message requests. Entitled exchange to create regiment. I need practice. You need practice. He needs practice. We need practice. <laughs> nah. Finger collisions when reaching for straws were not accidental. <laughs> but my online profile, dense with language dreams. No age, no self-summary, no profile photo, no PS, I've already learned body parts. But <laughs> it was just an exchange. <coughs> Lewis. I joined a Spanish class late. The teacher suggested one-on-one -on -one preparation time. Somewhere cultural. El Cuatro Gats. A gentleman played piano upon a platform. Tiled walls told stories of history. Our waiter, Jose, stood close by, white napkin draped over forearm, bottleneck to glass rim. I hid my yellow trainers. Absorbed the mosaics, the carvings. He unraveled his life. He slurped, we slurred, we left. The customary two besitos. Mwah, mwah. And then, just as I was turning to leave, replacing the connection of a lovely evening with a clear goodbye, he said, Don't be ashamed. It's my fault. He misread the makeup covering the grammar books beneath my eyes. Or I laughed, I smiled, I habitually raised my shoulder. <laughs> no. No, no, no. It's the language barrier. He meant don't be late. He embraced me. Carlos. A licked finger flipped through an English pocket guide beneath a parasol. Married with two children, he was improving his holiday and work prospects. We took notes. We suggested books. We laughed at pronunciation. He had bought the same yellow trainers for his daughter. We played flashcards and thesaurus. Then he forced me to ask for la cuenta, por favor. I walked him to his motorbike. Two kisses, adios. His words travelled faster than my dregs of energy. Wait, wait, I'll show you the lights. I'll take you for a night drive. I spat vocabulary in a fury. Apple, manzana, the day after tomorrow, huge, one times, two times, <laughs> nearly always. I'm lonely. Despite still believing that men and women could be more than just shapes, next time I will include P.S. I have already learnt body parts. Wow. Yeah. Yeah.